But really what they're going after here are people that are specifically streaming copyright works that they want to have a leg to stand on enforcement-wise. Because right now, unless you're running one of those organizations where you charge money to stream sporting events, you essentially charge cut rates. Right. They shut down a lot of those organizations. What they're trying, I believe, to do is cut down the gray area of people that are just putting stuff on YouTube that the copyright holder, holder might have a disagreement with having it spread. They essentially want to put some fear out there and have a leg to stand on if there's a serial offender to where they can press charges and have it be against the law. I, I don't like where this heads because, first oh, I of don't all, uh, and, and specifically, like you have an organization like uh, Blizzard that is, that is actively, actively trying to create Starcraft as a spectator sport. They yeah. want this kind of shout casting of, of all the games. Yeah. You have a brand new class of entertainer as these sports announcers for video games. This is shutting that down. And likewise, everybody who's developed, all of a sudden it becomes well, dangerous. Well, this doesn't shut it down. Be- if Blizzard says in their license, you're allowed to do this. This just says if you're not licensed to do it, then they have the right to shut you down. I think so. Blizzard's free to to say, "Oh, we're gonna we're gonna give you an exception in the terms yeah. for this for this video game." I, I I don't like the way we're all scared all 